Hi, I'm Deb Piercy from Summit Renovations and I'm going to give you my top three tips to help you decide whether to renovate and extend your home or demolish and build. So my first tip is to create a wish list. It's really important to be as comprehensive as you can with this because it will help you figure out whether it's right to demolish and build or renovate. Start with the big items such as your kitchen and your bathroom if they're priorities and then think about the overall design and layout of your home as well. Make your wish list as unique as you are. For example, if you've always dreamed of having a freestanding bath in your bedroom, write it down. From there, organise your wish list into three different categories. Your must-haves, your would-be-nice-to-haves, and if money were no object, you would love to include it. Then work with a designer who can help you bring your ideas to life. So my second tip is to do your preliminary research. This will help safeguard your most valuable investment, your home. After you've spoken to your bank or your mortgage broker, then it's time to reach out to your local council and see what plans they have on file for your existing home. Once you have those, it's time to sit down, have a coffee and talk with your designer. From there, we can determine whether your plans and your wish list are going to work with your existing house layout and your budget. My third and final tip is to consider your budget and your timeframes. Being open and transparent with your builder is key to making sure that we're setting clear expectations right from the outset. You understand how long it's going to take and how much it's going to cost. Your renovation expert should be able to give you a really clear idea of ballpark estimates and timeframes right from the outset. This may help make your decision much clearer for you as to whether to renovate or to build new. Also consider your living arrangements while your build is taking place, whether it's a renovation or a new build. If you decide to renovate, you may very well be able to stay in your home throughout the process, saving you thousands in potential rent.